The last 25 years of my career started in newspaper and have gone all the way through you know, search and media and, uh, and mobile. And in that 25 year period, most of the things I was working on were generating media impressions and, and selling them to marketers. Um, today, really, the DTX company, I'm launching to the other side of the marketplace, which is to spend time on the marketer side of the market. And, you know, I think my learnings from the last 25 years don't give me a total viewpoint on that space, but give me a lot of lessons from what I saw on the other side of the marketplace. So the future of what we're building today at the DTX company is really about treating brands and marketing in a way which is built for an omni-channel physical and online world, which a lot of people call O2O. Uh, but that's really something that I think is the future of, of marketing. And uh, you know, I think we'll end up working with all the partners that I was competing with or working for on the, on the media space. The media space in general has essentially hopped from medium to medium to medium. On the, con on the commerce side, there's been sort of this stark either offline or online and you know I think some companies have done it very successfully mixing the two if you look at Nike or Apple or uh, businesses like that or what Alibaba is doing in China um, but I, I think the notion of hopping and becoming more omni-channel is something that the commerce companies could learn to a big degree from the media companies and you know the media companies have gone through a lot of change and there's certainly struggles there in terms of getting to those models but at the end of the day you've seen some of them really make tremendous uh, progress it looks to me on the retail side like some of the retailers um, and some of the D2C brands, the people who kind of hop the fastest are probably going to have the best outcomes.